what's going on everybody january flowers here your favorite home girl and we just got news in from baddies of the caribbean sea our first mermaid has landed tommy and tommy is spilling d if you are new to the channel welcome if you are returning to the channel welcome back pool i know you got your sea legs come out the garden and get in the water pool tommy has went live tommy yeah. didn't spill tea saying that she was one of the first girls to arrive so the girls are obviously arriving separately or got separate groups they clicked up because look at this tommy said and for y'all that keep asking natalie isn't the one that brought her back fans in the twitter community x even on the youtube pages instagram pages they all been saying natalie brought her back to cause mess listen listen linda natalie had nothing to do with this and tommy is letting it be known and listen that is not the only BGC girls that Tommy has had her eye on. Uh-huh. Tommy is letting it be known that right behind her, the second set of girls to arrive were the Claremont twins. And Tommy is already letting it be known that if they want it, she got hands for both of them. I'm just like, this is crazy. Why are they having the girls arrive to the island separately? I'm just trying to understand it all. But y'all get into this clip and y'all know I got more to say after it. Tommy letting it be known. Get into this, y'all. So far, like, the Barbados, it look cool to me. It give me Jamaica. Shout out to Lemmy. Shout out to Lemmy. He always do his one, two. That's who pays me. That's who signs my checks. That's who show this is. And that's who called me and asked me to come on here. So, shout out to Lemmy. We had, me and him got a one-on-one -on -one, uh, relationship. I don't know what them hoes doing. I ain't even seek no hoes since I've been here. I ain't seen no hoes. I seen the Claremonts walking in. We we didn't speak nothing, nothing. They was talking to a group down nigga, and that was that. So, you know what I'm saying? I never had no smoke with them. If they won't smoke. They could get it. Anybody who wanted could get it. Because right now, I'm angry. On Actually, I want to fly nigga out here right now. But you know I can't do that because I ain't Natalie. <laughs> I ain't no sugar mama. Bitch. They do all flow. You dig. So far. I have to say, I am excited to see Tommy. I wasn't sure before, but she's already making me laugh and giggle. She's spilling tea in real time, and you know that always makes me favor a doll. Now, as far as her saying she got hands ready for the Claremonts, I don't know what those girls bring to the table, because what I know them of isn't throwing hands. I heard they throw lawsuits. So, you know, I don't really know them for that. And for Tommy to say she personally spoke to Lemmy to get on the latest season, ladies gentlemen this brings something different to the arena because no longer do these girls have to bow to the original nun it's giving me that hmm, if you hop skip into lemmy dms and now we know that he's not legally married for anyone who has morals he is a single black man with a business yes tommy is letting it be known that because now that i know a lot of girls who made this season had nothing to do with natalie I'm either going to see a lot of bullying or Natalie getting dusted the most this season. Either Natalie's going to get dusted the most this season since these girls weren't even picked by her. That's why we got the most from the auditions ever. If y'all noticed that, wow, wow, as far as replacement goes, I see that. But um, I'm interested to see what Tommy's going to bring to the table, but I don't want to see Tommy jumped. I'll be honest. If all the BGC girls being clicked up, which people keep telling me that Natalie, Jayla, Shannon, and Shanid, if I'm saying it right, you said they already have good friendships. Who will be new to me, but I hope they ain't on no jumping stuff because who is Tommy already linked with on cast? Tommy already got people who are going to be coming for her. You see what I'm saying? I don't know. Not to say Tommy's going to be a wink link. You know, Tommy can take a puncher deal, but I don't want to see no jumpery. You see what I'm saying? If it's going to be one-on-ones, 
Let it be one-on-ones. But let's see what some other people are saying in the comments. Somebody said Nat responded. Oh, Nat reposted this. Really? Oh, they said Nat reposted this. Somebody else said Lemmy did not call Natalie and say, Hey, I'm starting a baddie show and I need you to EP on it. Natalie brought her show and her girls to his network. His network, her show. Oh, wow. Someone said this why I don't like her. Tommy was telling us about Natalie. Someone said, I'm just happy to see Tommy. Someone else said, she needs to lay off the liquor. Oh my gosh. Someone said, I ain't no sugar mama. Somebody else said, she's a Gemini. She just beefing with herself right now. <laughs> Somebody said, Tommy, love after the boxing match. I don't think you can fight. You let me down too many times. I know she didn't win any of her fights. Somebody else said, bye, Tommy. Bye, I love Tommy so much. Somebody else says she better leave the Claremont twins alone. Ooh, this brings up a thought. Would fans of this season be more on Claremont's side or Tommy's side? Now, they both fashion girls. Let's stop playing, y'all. They both fashion girls. They both surge girls. Now, you know, the surgery levels are different. Yes, you know, <laughs> surgery levels are rising. Yes. Um, uh -huh. Someone said, who cares? She the face of the show. I still don't respect her coming back. Maybe you will lose money for causing motion. Oh, mm -mm. somebody said, ain't no sugar mama. Somebody else said a grouped out nigga. That is who they be with. It is. Ain't nothing wrong with it. I mean, everybody wants to know why I don't need one around. Carry your bags, you know, dry your dif different locations. Somebody else said, I want to dismantle Natalie's place so bad. They need to cancel her. We're going to do one more, y'all. She said, I'm trying to see her feet. Natalie Nunn. Wow, will we get that? Why would Natalie send the other BGC girls ahead of her, though, but for she arrives? So, did Tommy say she's in Barbados, but it reminds her of Jamaica? I think that's what she said. Let me see. Alright, like, the Barbados, it look cool to me. It give me Jamaica. Shout out to Lemmy. Shout out to Lemmy. He always do his one, two. That's who pays me. That's who signs my checks. That's who show this is. And that's who called me and asked me to come on here. And I believe her. I do believe he made that phone call. He brought her down. And, you know, they know what it'll give for the fans or the viewers. You know, we haven't seen Tommy since season three. You know, she's a girl who's willing to be a returning queen. Um, Her fans have something to cheer for. Me personally, if Tommy was heavy handed, I think that would just add to everything that comes with her. But it's so many different personalities, including all of hers on this season so we'll see you <laughs> okay so natalie has responded to tommy in real time y'all this is good it's 20 minutes ago that's actually how long ago i started doing and editing this video and i'm actually glad that reality tv blog spot caught this so natalie said but hey we can come on my show and we can talk it out make me some more money and pay you your talent fee little miss tommy and matter of fact if you square up i'll double it and pay you whatever let me paid you aka baby sweetie wow and she even reposted the whole story that I was just sharing with y'all as good as 10 minutes ago. Natalie woke. Wow. She said the tweaker Tommy, she's a op and a cop. Got your papers? You work for the feds? Stay tuned. Natalie isn't playing with her. She said that swears she's so gangster and sits on every podcast and live online and talks the most i smell a rat i need to see miss tommy paperwork because 16 mug shots and you still claim you hood but still got a passport still outside running around go to jail and get right out i smell a op aka a cop she's the police on period natalie wow that must have really bothered her wow tommy got under her skin not only did she get to the island first, she's having conversations with Lemmy behind Natalie's back. She even put Lemmy in her post, Natalie mad that Lemmy let us know that Natalie is no more than a hired hand. Wow. Natalie from the beginning didn't give me that. She kind of gave me what she always said. This is my show. It's mine. Because she fights everybody who challenged her on the show. And now to know 
you know what the ultimate gut punch and i wonder if lemmy is bold enough to do it y'all we should place a poll in the chat is lemmy bold enough to remove natalie from the middle of the spot on this year's poster stop playing stop playing stop playing is lemmy still that mad at her not only is he bringing down hella ops <laughs> Do you see them being bold enough to remove her from the middle spot? Who will be in the middle then? Child, I don't know, yo. She mad in real time. What are people saying in the comments? Somebody said, well, if it's your show, then why does anyone else have the power to cast? I'm confused. Calling her a rat is diabolical. She definitely want to fight. <laughs> right? Somebody said, not swear this is her show, but be so for real. You wouldn't have a show if the network didn't bring your ideas in, even though it's really Sarah and Christina's ideas. Wow, somebody got to help me out with this. I've heard bits and pieces of Sarah and Tina's tea, but I need to know, y'all. Is Natalie getting exposed in the 24? Wow, let's see. Someone said, but didn't Miss Leaks already say no power and you didn't check her? Dot, dot, dot. Right, NeNe called Natalie out in real time and she cowered down. She bucked down in real time. Someone else said, this is the same person I was bragging about talking to the police on Joslyn. By Lance. Wow. Not the Players Club. Shout out to Lisa. Hey, Ray. Somebody else said, Nappy talking too spicy. Somebody said, being called a rat is the utmost disrespectful. People come up missing with those kind of claims. Shaking my head. If you really from the streets, then you know not to throw that around. I pecan brown um pecan i agree with you because you don't call somebody that unless you really know true t and it's like she's trying to get either people who rule with tommy or people who associate with it a second guess her or now question her you see what i'm saying in her ways and that's not right if you really don't know for sure what that girl is giving up to get out of those certain opportunities or situations but, eh, you know, all the girl said was you aren't the one who brought me on the show and she willing to pop your homegirls. I mean, is that enough to go off? Possibly. You know, they TV girls. So y'all comment below. Let me know what y'all think. This stuff is happening in real time. Um, yeah, stay locked to the channel because I will keep you up to date with all the latest tea. And remember this, do the best you can with what you got. And I will see you on my next video. Y'all, what are the age ranges of these girls? Tommy, Natalie, and the Claremonts. Are they all? I'm, mm, 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 mm. I just want to know. Because, like, what? at what point do you get mad like this? And Tommy didn't even seem that mad for real. Seemed like she just was talking. You know, I got to the island first and boy. Child. Mm, 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 mm. Natalie ain't playing this season. She mad. I'll see y'all in the next one. Mm -hmm. Have a good day.